we're going to play alone. I want to show you something. Movie night or shared story. So, I don't know what movie night is. It's in a bunch of them, and I don't know what it is. Shared story is just playing together, which I can't do because none of my friends bought it. They don't love me. There's the murder castle that they speak of. Now, you see these people? When you guys play, you get to choose a role when you play with other people. Like, they'll have, like, there's, I'm pretty sure, another person. And they'll have all four of them, and then you just put your name under the one you want to be, or whatever. Alright, new story. Yes, I've played this twice already. We're going to do challenging, because that's normal. See, as you see there, I got 6% and 12%. But I had to delete them and start over, because both times it was late at night. I wanted to play, but it just wasn't working. I was literally falling asleep on stream, and who knows what the hell I was saying. So here we go. For they have sown the wind, and they shall reap the whirlwind. Every choice has a consequence, and it does. Depending on what you pick depends on how the story plays out. Some decisions save lives, which I'm horrible at. I'll just tell you that now. Others. Lead to death. That's what I'm good at, killing people. I think I've the most I've saved was half. And that was in House of Hope. And on that one, I was controlling a lot of people. A lot more than four. I'm attempting to. 260 foot Ferris wheel? In 1893? Oh, that's dangerous. Whatever pleases All right, we're playing as Maria at the World's Fair Hotel. You mean you are not weary of me after an entire day of marriage? I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm weary of everybody. I think we've arrived. We have arrived. I'm guessing this is the murder hotel from what it showed in the picture. Yeah. Oh, it's nice. As yes, it is. Very nice. Okay. Okay. Let's check in. Another little spoiler. In every game, the first two people, you cannot save them. It's impossible. I played this two times, and each time I went the other way. It's impossible. And I don't like my husband, because he seems like a douche. He's very impatient. He just comes off cocky. I don't like him. I wouldn't have married that man's. Someone else take that man's. There you go. That's good enough. Uh-huh. You see the skeleton? Remember what I said. Keep your eyes open. Oh, God, here he goes. We'll be reassuring. Everyone must be busy elsewhere. That's no way to run a business. Sir, if he runs it by himself, what do you expect? Everything is perfect. Exactly. Always finding that silver lining. Looks like she has to with your ass around. We're both startling you and mm -hmm. my attention is needed elsewhere. I promise from here on out it will be nothing but silver linings. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Please sign in here. First time in Chicago. I'm going to hazard a guess and assume you're here to take in the exposition. The fair, yes, but that's not all. Today is a very special day for us. Oh, a honeymoon. How very, very lovely. <clears throat> Perhaps my wife, Mrs. Whitman, would like to sign. Yes, today's the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. In that case, an upgrade is in order. A honeymoon suite it is. 
Oh, well, uh, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> I think nothing of it. The same rates as your regular room. The upgrade is on us. You're our first honeymooners. How kind. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry Howard Holmes. You have a lovely hotel, Mr. Holmes. Well, thank you very much. I designed and built most of it myself. You're an architect, then? Architect, designer, builder, doctor, artist. I'm a man of many interests. Impressive. Please, have a look around. We have sundries and gifts at the pharmacy counter. I'll take your luggage up to your room and ensure that everything is in order. Just make a note if you decide to purchase anything, and we will add it to your bill. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. We appreciate it. The pleasure is all mine. Now, what did I forget to bring? Oh, pardon me, miss. Careful, you. My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm. <laughs> he sounds like a ripe fellow. How's the marriage going? Lovely. Thanks for asking. Well, let's just head up. I'm sure the room is ready. See anything good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Wouldn't you like to know? Wonder what's in here. I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. Ferris wheels, forbidden rooms. Are we looking for excitement? Perhaps. <sighs> Perhaps. Nothing but an unfinished room. See what happens when you chase a thrill? If this is you trying to get out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Wait, what's that? <gasps> Don't move. <laughs> Sorry. Are we lost? A wrong turn, it would seem. This room is being renovated. It's not safe. Of course. We... You must have missed the sign saying private. Must have. We're very sorry. I can't have you falling through floors and having your brains dashed out, can I? No. Again, we apologize. Think nothing of it. I'm only thinking of your safety. Wouldn't want you to get hurt. <laughs> Welcome, newlyweds, to the honeymoon suite. <laughs> Thank you kindly, Mr. Holmes. 
do enjoy your stay. If you'll excuse me, I have work to return to. I'm sure we'll see each other again soon. <laughs> Goodness, this place is fit for a king. Or my queen. Oh, you. Kiss this. That is not very wifely of you. Hey! Ah, bullseye! You asked for it. <laughs> Should I be frightened? If you're smart. Mercy, mercy. Okay, you win. Anything broken? Only my pride. How about a peace offering? Hmm. This feels like some sort of treacherous plot. Not at all. I have a gift for you. Close your eyes, face the mirror. Aren't you clever and romantic? If I get a pillow to the face, I will sock you right in the kisser. <laughs> Is there a problem? No. Open your eyes. Oh, Jeff, it's lovely. I love it. Good. <laughs> Victory is mine. I'll let you have that bath now. jammed shut maybe if we put a little weight into it <sighs> open sesame <laughs> thank you why don't you have a shave while i take a quick bath then we can reconvene i know that word it's french for something illicit <laughs> shush shave i think i forgot to pack my razor and kit I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. Don't you worry. What?
Is that you, darling? Jeff? Oh, are we playing another game? Okay, Mr. Sneaky. You can't sneak up on me, Mr. <gasps> Holmes. Hello, my What are dear. you doing in here? Jeff! I don't think he can quite hear you. <laughs> Stop! Get away from me! But I'm not finished yet. I said get... Don't fight it. Would we'll only hurt more if you do. <coughs> We're only prolonging the inevitable. What? What are you? What have you done? Calm yourself, sir. I've seen your wife has had an accident. Is there a problem, sir? You're wasting your last chance to tell him that you love him. A place for everything, everything in its place. Well, look at this. Oh, it's wonderful. Only the best for you, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, popular. good man, do you work here? Hello, welcome to the World's Fair Hotel.
are here. Have you been waiting long? Welcome to my repository, a vast collection of stories that are dark, frightening, horrific. I am the curator. It's so good to have company. For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time when I wasn't here, watching over these tales. And what good are stories without somebody to experience them? This is a story about those who create and the lengths they might go to for their art to be made pure. Art can elicit all sorts of reactions. Delight, inspiration, desire, yes, but also doubt, fear, dread. The way you react, the decisions you make, would affect this story. Hidden in the world, you'll find dark pictures. They give glimpses of the possible consequences of your choices, and sometimes, it's the smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions. You're responsible for what happens. You're culpable. I can't interfere. That's very much against the rules. I can only observe what happens and record any significant events. Oh. Ever seen one of these? They're very old. People used to call them obols. They'd put them in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Look out for them. You'll find them in the strangest places. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find, and I'll certainly make it worth your while. Well, shall we start? Game is afoot. I will be watching. My name is Kate Wilder. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. You may have recently seen my interview on Chicago AM on... Uh, uh, and, uh, and, yeah, it's really tough when just being honest means everyone thinks you're a bitch. I'm not sure I've got issues to deal with, same as everyone. I I'm working on it. I... I'm Mark. I study photography at UCLA. Um, at a great time. Really want to get back into some serious photography. Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a job. I've been a key group in lighting tech for years. See a problem? Light it. You don't often meet someone like that. Man, how do you even start? I'm sick of being on my own. Sorry, do you start with qualifications or, um, like, personal info? Because I don't, I mean, will anyone access this? I'm kind of private, actually. Uh, yeah, Charlie Lonnett, UK originally. I've uh, been here for 20 years. The last series was so on track. It was, uh, it was a very beautifully conceived and, um, didn't quite, uh, uh hit the mark as I would. It's a fucking mess, to be honest with you. I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You don't seem to understand. I was born with the devil in me. I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. Bury me deep, Your Honor. Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else and cover the ground with more cement. Cause trust me. Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, a.k.a. Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Records indicate he hung, slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes, 
until finally the monster was dead. America's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders, but as investigators sifted through the traces he left behind, following his path from city to city, the number grew significantly, nearly 200 lives. America's first serial killer, and possibly the worst. He was buried as Okay, the way she looks the and the way he's dressed, they're not in the same time. So, is this like a video? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? So, it seems to be. What do you think? That's right. Who is that person we just seen? Oh, it's her. Right? Yeah. To be honest, Charlie, this is a pilot. Hold that Shit, thought. yeah. Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking. Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What do Dumet, do there's a picture. Mr. Dumet. Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. Okay, we'll hear you out. I'm certainly grateful to you, Mr. <clears throat> Dumet. This all sounds amazing, but I, uh, I just, I'm waiting to hear what the catch is. No offense. None taken. I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much, but my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon, 4 p.m. Be okay. ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days' shoot. I've told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Without them, mm -hmm. this conversation is dead in the water. We, uh... I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? I mean, you can't blame him. If it's like an all-expense-paid thing, I promise. can't make him wait, you know? Okay, okay, nice car. Mr. Dumet send you. We... I guess right. that's a yes, but that's kind of creepy. Guys. All right. I'm good. We're on our way to this weird place. Are you? With a weird person we've never met. Look at the driver. They have gloves on. Why are they wearing gloves? Adventure. Simon. Like, I don't understand. Anyone? Road trip! Huzzah! Woohoo! Hooray. This is gonna be great, guys. Like, you only wear gloves if you don't want your fingerprints to be found. Where are we going exactly? You don't have surprises. You know what this just reminds me of? Don't say it. Topeka. What's Jack. Topeka? Me, no money in my pocket. A dead phone and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault. Because you fly by the seat of your ass. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's rich. He's a recluse. He's obsessed with H.H. H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. Kind of sounded like him, too. From a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Some of the rooms are full recreations from the murder castle. Dumet has wow. documents, artifacts. When I said this would save the show, I was not exaggerating. Yeah, I if you live to it. This. Just trust me. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones for safekeeping. While this may sound strange that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices that may share part information of the that could affect know about my this? business or lifestyle. Okay. Mm rules. All footage you wish to use must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. I must insist. Privacy and discretion, but you're letting him, Look, letting them film you. your entire property. Okay. His pay, but he isn't. If this is all he asks, then we do it. Yeah, but it seems kind of weird. For the show. You get to take a recording device in there, but not your phone. Doesn't make sense to me. Just doesn't. The only reason I could think they don't want the phones to be taken in 
And so they have no way to call for help. That's what I'm thinking. If this dude is so rich, shouldn't he have service or something? He's not making y'all pay. Everything's free. You can carry your own shit. No, really. I got it. Thanks, bro. Don't sweat it. He's not. Like, that just sounded so entitled, it just makes me want to scream. You have done nothing so far but ride okay. there and you can't carry your own equipment. Like, what the no. fuck is wrong with you? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and the scope of this. Not with all the mist and fog. Then, Why not? On high, we'll get a it would look good and spooky. That's certainly um, up there. The, the visuals will be great and we can frame up over the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. <laughs> Mark, this is crazy. A butcher's dog. We'll be fine. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice knowing you. Oh, shut up. I do not like her very much so far. Shoot some footage from the top of the lighthouse. Do we have anything yet? No, okay, so let's just go. Oh, we can run now. Approach the wall near the collapsed steps and press A. I will. But you have to look everywhere. We gotta find those little coins and stuff, remember? Because those little coins are how we buy clues from what's gonna happen farther in the game. But just let me say, they might be clues, but they're not, like, clues like you're thinking. The clues literally last, like, three, four seconds. No joke. Ups we go. I would not be wearing white sneakers out there, okay? Okay. I am going to run. Hurry up. Run it. Shut the hell up. Damn, we literally went like five feet and you're already rushing. Okay, nothing. Oh, Jesus. That scared me. Well, yeah, I know that in theory, but. What's this? Warning cliff erosion. Cliffs are subject to erosion and may collapse into deep water without warning? Ugh, better not drop me into no damn deep water. I'm gonna say we trusted and not die. Nah, this sign is something the lawyers made them put up. I'm sure it's fine. Nothing? Okay, down we go. Yeah, I'm sure it's not fine, Charlie, but whatever. Listen, Mark, I just wanted to say, um, thanks for backing me up, man. What? About getting this footage? No, for the whole trip. You know some of the crew can be challenging. To work with. Okay. Then Kate would never have agreed to come if you hadn't been on board. I figured that the episode was such a mess. We needed all Jump down. We gotta look right. for any of those little ones we could yeah. find. There's only been one of the four games where the curator wasn't that guy. One of the games, it was a, uh, like a gypsy lady. She was like a fortune teller. Nothing so far. Because trust me, yes, they will give you that little sparkle to let you know. But sometimes you won't always be able to see it. Okay, I won't lie. I was hoping being here all remote and away from the world that maybe I'd have some downtime since space could decompress. Downtime? Why would you want to do that? You know. Why not? Relax a bit. I've never seen the attraction. In memory of the victims of the great storm of May 1st, 1907, in which 187 lives were lost. The crew and passengers of the XX Cassiopeia, which crashed into the rocks at the base of these cliffs. Wow. Okay, that's awful. Okay, still none of the obelisks. Sure, I think it's what they were called. Yes, I get it. Hey, jump. Look, we were just over there. Now we're all the way up here. No flashlight, no nothing. What the hell? Get going. Okay, X. 
Well, we can just climb through the side right there. Oh, we have a lighter. Yes, sir. Not the greatest, but it's going to keep us from falling down the deep pit to hell. One week wrap, I'd like to take a couple weeks off. Go see my family. I need you in post. I really appreciate that concerning eye of yours, you know. I've got a lot going on at the moment, Charlie. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Sure. Take a Don't be a douche, Charlie. Get your head together. I appreciate it. I'll be fine in post for a while. Oh, whether you are or not, it don't matter. You got any family you can go and bother? Oh, well. Doesn't seem like much of a family man. Okay, still no coin jet. <laughs> How's that marriage working out? Exactly. Well, from what I hear about real marriages, pretty damn good. To balance across rocks and fallen trees. And trust me, you can fall. I don't want to fall because I don't want to do all that to get back up there, but. Or maybe I do. Maybe I do. Maybe there's a queen down there. Yeah, I'm gonna fall. Okay, let's balance and I'll show you. Come on, just fall off, Charlie. What the hell? Maybe I can't fall off? Come on. Come on. Oh, it won't let me fall. Great. So, if it won't let me, I'm guessing there's not a queen down there. I think it won't let me because there's no way back up. That's what it is. Okay. Let's go look for coins and take pictures. That's why I keep running up and down each side. Is because you'll get a notification. If you pay attention. Jesus fucking Christ! Oh, what the hell is that? A mannequin. Yeah, oh. Just hanging out. Maybe it's part of some old museum display. I'm not a big... Right. Don't get me that's wrong. I love jump scares, but I don't do well with them. That's the difference. You right there, Charlie? Sorry, that sounded weird. I got so scared I smacked my damn mic. Oh, I feel something. Oh, it's just that. How have we yet to find a coin? Like I'm... Maybe there is none yet, but damn. Alright, up to Daisy. Let's go. It's a beautiful view. Damn, get out of my way, my guy. All right, let's see. Charlie and Aaron. That's her. Jamie is the one I don't like. Kate. Mark's who we're with now. I am determined, overbearing, cynical, careless, and cunning is just popping in and out of view. Explore cliffs to find an alternative route. Take footage from the top of the lighthouse. And we have five? Of, I don't know what those are at the moment. Okay, we don't have anything to look at. Call from Grantham Dumet. Accepted an invitation to his H.H. Holmes inspired murder castle. Yeah, I don't know how good that's going to go for you, but whatever. I'm coming. Yeah, just looking at the light on the mist. How is that going to fit into the show? It just caught my eye. Coming. Always the photographer. I can't exactly turn it off. There's a lot of crossovers between the creative stuff and the commercial stuff. Mm. Oh, wait. Do we... Are you sure about that? Oh, I thought I saw a sparkle. Hasn't exactly we agreed to let that drop for the weekend. Just making sure your head's in the game. I'm looking around all this before I go do anything. Okay, we can go through there. 
We can go through there. So we'll go hit this way first. Oh, it's locked. Whoa, what is that? Is that where the horn came from that we heard? Okay, we can go in that window. Oh, in we go. This would be so much fun. I love exploring abandoned buildings. And the lighter is on. Okay, what's this? This thing hasn't been manned in ages. So why's the horn still gone? Because they didn't decommission the fog. It's all automatic now. Vacation time. Okay, then. Got it. That's all for there. You're not coming in, Mark? Are you scared? What's this? Read, please. 410, oh damn it, gotta hold it. 410 of 2000. Keep it up, team. This should be the final week. Last night's foghorn test was successful. Looks like the automation is all up and running. We'll do one final trial today, then we can pack away the kit. A couple of you have reported that homeless guy hanging around again. We're going to be bumping up security, the compound, and conducting final checks today and tomorrow just to be on the safe side. Don't want anyone getting injured. Other than that, the work's been great, all project. So let's keep up the pace, and we'll be out of here by the end of the week. Okay. Guess that was left for whoever was here last. Fuses. There's the tanks for whatever. Can we open it? No. And there's no coins in here? I've never found all of the clues in any of the games. So I'm just trying my best to... Uh... Alright, let's go. Not miss as much as I can. Okay, we didn't find none out here. Alright. Let's go. Check up here first. Lock tight. Yep, we're not getting in that way. Oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? A newspaper? Great Lakes Sorry. Post? Exciting times. That's it? Alright. We found something. Not what I wanted, but something nonetheless. Right, let's squeeze her on through. Crawl underground level gaps. You call that a that's an yeah, that's an army crawl, right? See that? Maybe it's just the light. Okay. Come on, I think you're out enough. You guys hear the bugs buzzing? Nice little detail. Okay, before we open that, anything? No. <coughs> Got it halfway through, let's go. What? What the hell's everybody looking at? Okay, I have not been any farther than this when I was falling asleep. I don't even remember this. Oh, Jesus. Crow? Oh, this hello. Green cares equip items they have in their inventory. Okay, so let's equip this and let's pick it open. Okay, I get it. Let's do it. 
Oh, we found one. What's that? Just some old coin. Obels, not obelisks. Obelisks are from work. <laughs> Obels. Can be used to unlock dioramas. Oh, wait, does that mean... Oh, we've got six of them? Holy shit. Is that for this? Select, okay, what the fuck? Look, that is Mr. Dumet. That's the guy that invited us. Like, why are these? What, these are videos? What? Okay, guys. View video. Never mind. So let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve videos out of all of these pictures. Okay, I guess, yeah, I guess we'll, hold on, that's where it starts. I guess we'll figure out when we go back Sorry to the guy. Now and again, but I really couldn't make these shows without you. That's not true. So you the give them a hard time? The Lonnet Entertainment Car, but you're the one who keeps the engine going. Pushed and pulled. That's okay. Not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. I get it. Okay. X to grab, and L to move. Okay. Turn it around. No, no, wrong way. Ah, I suck. I'm one of those people. My OCD, it's got to be even and straight. There we go. Okay, before I do that, let's check up here. Of course not. But I still needed to check. Just so the game knows I checked it. Oops, a daisy, Charlie. Little breaking and entering. How are you not in jail? Nah. <laughs> not really breaking and entering though, is it? They know we're here. Doesn't look like anyone stays here, so what the fuck was that? Christ, what the hell is that? Hidden place and LT to hide. Okay, great. LT. LT. This one, LT, come on. <gasps> there we go, we did it. Crew members won't be spotted when open. Or when hiding. What the fuck was that? Nice to meet you too. That thing was like crawling on all fours and ran out the window. Great. Love that. Alright, let's look around in each room first. Lots of bottle. I thought that was blood. See, the other game did not show you where to hide. Just knew you had to hide, that was all. And the other game also oh there's the vision. I showed you guys ahead of time. Alright, so we gotta be careful. Either the boat had explosive or the rocks had explosive. I don't know which. Explosion, okay. Like I was gonna say at the other games, you had to like look up in the trees and catch a glimpse of cards and things that were up in the trees and then press A to collect them. So I don't know if this game's quite like that or not, so we'll find out. Get your skinny ass through there. This needs some fresh sheets, some nice drapes. Mm-hmm. I agree with you, Mark. This is a cute little house though, I ain't gonna lie. Oh, so I guess he does get exhausted. That's why I stopped, because he's breathing. I make sure I don't run all the time. Which I'm prone to do, because I'm very impatient. Yeah, don't think. What the fuck is that? Squirrels, rats, owl. Or not the crow. Rabbits. Jesus, what the hell? 
Funny if he ain't the word. What's over here? Oh god. What in God's name is this? Ah! It moved. Did it just fucking try to bite me? It moved. I'm trying to look at it. Oh, it's got batteries in its head. Ew, what the fuck? Let's put shit down. Who wants to put batteries in its head? What kind of shit is that? Wings over there. Okay. Fuse box. That way, maybe. Yeah. Oh, look. Up we go. It's gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. That is gonna make some nice shots for look at video. This. I won't lie. It's perfect. Come on, get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. Okay. Over there. Come on. The lighthouse was over there. What the fuck? It's all right. Come on. We better get back. Now they didn't zoom into the lighthouse for sure. Guess I did what I could. Uh, that's Mr. Dumet. We just had the one call. Uh, how did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I didn't ask. That's weird. Let's just play nice, okay? Hello, Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Dumet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. This is Mark. Mark. Erin, Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? Okay. Looks like he doesn't like being on that island. Of course. Was it your great uncle you said that? Um... Let's get to where we're going. I'll explain everything later. Sure. He seems very jumpy. Just saying, just saying. Is that being pulled across by chains? It is. Well, that's different. Yeah, see, somebody's watching us. But that thing that climbed out the window did not seem human. I don't like her. I like everybody but her on the end. That's where we zoomed into, so... Yeah. We were the- we were zooming into the layouts where we were. There's a person. See him? Who the hell is that? Let's get up to the hotel. Uh, please, let's... Stay close. Stick together. Is it dangerous here? No. Of course not. You sure? Because you don't seem sure. Exactly. It's perfectly safe. But we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt. So please, take care. Okay. Looks like things have buttoned up tight around here. God. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure they're brought. Not dressed for a hike. Try not to cough up a lung, Charlie. We're going to go with annoyed because she seems to be an annoyed type of bitch. It's just a short walk. It won't take long. Anxious. Right. Yes, he is anxious. Security, very seriously. I wonder what he's afraid will get in. Maybe you should be asking what he's trying not to let out. Jamie. Just saying. If you watch too many horror movies. Yeah, but because of that, that she'll long. probably last longer. I've that for about two hours. Just go. Mark, get your camera. I want to grab a quick intro from here. I need some shots leading up to the house. Don't need the whole journey. Kate, talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, okay? No photos. No recording of me at all. Is that clear? Okay. I'm a very private person. 
Don't worry, Mr. Tim. Okay, nothing of you. Is Lona Entertainment's motto. You want the usual intro stuff, Charlie? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. Okay. Well, that was so snappy, perfect. snappy. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. <laughs> Rolling. Speed. And action. I've just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from H.H. H. Holmes' reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house. I'm not controlling it. They are. Okay, that's enough. And cut. We really do need to get going. Anything you say, Mr. Dumas. This way. You'll still okay. Some shots, right? Obviously. Who is that? Oh, it's the guy getting our bags, but like, why is he dressed so weird? Mr. Dumet is being really restrictive. I noticed. I want you to go look around without him knowing. The man is entitled to his privacy. He's cagey. I want to know what he's trying to hide. This is where shit goes, goes bad. What you did that time with those cops in Glendale. Seriously? Ah! Oh, ow! Oh, oh my! Damn it! What happened? You okay? Did you grab your ego again? No. We should get her up to the hotel. Oh my god, I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Remember how you patched her up? In Glendale? Oh, right. Okay. We'll find some ice and a bandage and come back. Do you have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. Mm. What is going on? Come on. I'll clue you in later. See. Y'all just listen, do what he said. What's Charlie want? Everything will be fine. But no. the scouts because I'm charming and you can hotwire your way past security. Come on. See, I like Kate. But I don't know so much about Jamie. All right. We're going to leave part one there. It's probably way longer than it should be. I apologize. But, you know, when you get started, things take a little longer. But I hope you guys are enjoying this. And when we come back, we're going to see where Jamie and Kate go and what they get themselves into. And I'm sure it's not going to be anything good. So remember, leave me a like and a comment. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.